I want to find the derivative of ln of 3 to the 5x. Now, before we take the derivative, we can take advantage of the log properties. So if I have ln of x to the n, that's the same thing as bringing the exponent in front and multiplying by ln of x. So in this example, the exponent is 5x, so we're going to bring it out in front and multiply by 3, ln 3. Now 5 and ln of 3 are constants, and you're multiplying it by x, so the derivative is just a constant, and that's 5 ln 3. So this is the easy way to do it. Now let's look at a different way. Okay, so we know that in general, if I take the derivative of ln of u, it's going to be 1 over u du. So in our case, u plays the role of 3 to the 5x. So when I take the derivative, that's just going to be 1 over the inside. And then we're going to multiply by the derivative of the inside. So this looks like a to the x. Right? So the derivative of a to the x is itself times natural log of a. So we know that it's going to be itself, and we're going to take the derivative, we're going to multiply by ln of the base, but because we have chain rule, we want to also multiply by the derivative of the exponent, and that's going to be 5. So I'm just going to put the 5 out in front. Okay, so the 5 is going to be multiplying everything. Now, 3 to the 5x will cancel, so you have 5 times ln of 3. Notice we get the same exact answer, but we showed a lot more work for to get that.